Hey, friends! Would you like to go on a ride with me? Let's go! We've now arrived at the train station. I'm stopping. Oh. Hey, it's Bear's birthday today. Happy birthday, Bear. Yeah. Hey, Bear baked a cake for his birthday. He wants all the passengers to have a piece of cake. How many pieces should he cut the cake into? Hmm. We need to count how many passengers there are in the train car. One, two, three, four. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Oh no! There's no cake left for Bear. Huh? Ah. <laughs> One, two, three, four. <laughs> Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday, dear bear! Ready? Take a deep breath! Backing up! Backing up! Zebra, you're welcome to board the train. <laughs> huh? <laughs> oh, the train car is too small. We need a bigger train car. Let's see if there's a bigger train car available. Hey, Zebra! Wait a minute! Here, try the purple train car. It's bigger. Aha! The purple train car is just right! One, two, three... Toot toot! Hold on tight! <laughs> We've now reached the final stop. Everyone, please exit the train safely. Goodbye. Goodbye. All of my friends have left the train. We can now continue. <laughs> huh? Mrs. Goose, what's wrong? Uh-huh. You have a violin. You forgot something that goes with a violin. Don't worry, Mrs. Goose. Let's look for it in the yellow train car. A pencil. 
paintbrush. That's what you forgot. Oops. Of course not. A paintbrush doesn't go with a violin. Maybe a sombrero hat. It suits you. But it doesn't go with a violin either. A bow. That's what you forgot. Great. The bow goes perfectly. Goodbye, Mrs. Goose. Goodbye, my friends. See you all tomorrow. Doo-doo!